to channel for another video, another match day vlog. Top of the table, Mansfield come to Rodney Parade. You know, they're top of the league. They've got some very, very good footballers in their team. Keller Dunn is, you know, probably one of the best players in the league. You know, they're a very solid side. They're top of the league for a reason. But the last couple of teams that have come to Rodney Parade in sort of the top four, top five of the league, Stockport, Wrexham, you know, we've both beat them at Rodney Parade. So as much as they beat us at Mansfield and at Mansfield, they were by far the better team. There was only one team playing that day and it was uh, the team from Nottinghamshire. So, you know, I do expect a tough game, but at Rodney Parade, I fancy us. I really do fancy us. Naive or, you know, biased, whatever you may think, but it's going to be an interesting one. If you do enjoy the vlog, like, share and subscribe. I'm sure this is going to be a very, very good game. We've got to turn up. We cannot do what we've done against MK Dons and not count. We've got to show Mansfield that we're going to fight. My prediction, 1-0. I'm going to go 1-0. Goal scorer, I'm going to go Aaron Wildig. I don't know why, but I'm going to go Aaron Wildig, 1-0. Apparently, Aaron Lewis is on the bench for Mansfield. So, you know, hopefully he doesn't come on and score against us. That'll be our luck. But we'll meet up with Luke, get his predictions and see the lineup. Come on the port. Johnson, Mansfield at home. Hello, hello, hello. What's your thoughts? I'm really, really confident for it, you know. Because every time we have a bigger club come here, they they struggle. I know it's different comparing like Stockport and Wrexham to like Man United, but they came here, went 2-0 up and then they, they struggled a little bit. You could argue Stockport and Wrexham are better than Man United this season. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but no, if, if we want to get to the playoffs, which you know, at the start of the season, it did look very, very unlikely. It looked like we could have easily gone down. But I I can't see anything else other than a Newport win. I've only got 3-1. Goal scorers? Well, Evans Hattrick. Well, Evans Hattrick. Is yeah. Aaron Lewis coming on the bench and scoring? I think he's going to come on, but he's going to get rattled. Just, up get, the just get two foot up the county. Now, what are we saying for this big game at Ronnie Parade? Nick Townsend, James Clark, Kyle Jamieson, Matt Baker, Lewis Payne, Adam Lewis, Super Scott Bennett. Aaron Wildig, Bryn Morris, Will Evans and Seb Palmer Holden. I've seen uh, Macca on the bench, sorry. Uh, on the bench, Tony Maxted, uh, Drysdale, Bright, Waite, Charlesley, Zanzala and um, Luke Jeffcott. Again, like I said, Shane McGottlin out for the season, Delaney out for the season, so James Sun and Payne will probably be the two that come in for the rest of the season for them two absentees. Jeff got on the bench again. I mean, look, I don't blame Graham Cotland for starting Will Evans and Palmer Holden again. They, they, their link up together is incredible. Zanzala on the bench offers that extra option as well. I'm confident. Come on. We'll get us under air on the parade. Corner four. It's just a bit flat, isn't it? Like, it doesn't help this bad rep, but can't exactly blame the poor officials for the lack of, well, energy. It just yeah. seems tired. First five, first like 10, 15 minutes, I thought we played really well. Like, we kept up the game of the ball, but the speed of the game, but no, they started to control the ball, they started to put their foot on the ball and sort of like making use of the chances that they do get. What do you think the full-time prediction will be? I think it's going to be one goal, in it? I think it's going to be 1-0. I'm not sure who to, it's quite hard to tell, but, you know, we've had a couple of chances, but I don't think we've been good enough to serve anything. I'm going to go 1-0 to Manfield. I just got that feeling they're going to nick it. Yeah, I'm going 1-0 County. I think we'll still nick it. There's enough in this first half that showed me we can nick it. But, like I said, big second half to come. Come on. Get rid of it. Is anyone going to go to it? Time! 
goal. We're doing well, we're doing a goal for the visitors, scored by number 10, George Maurice. You've got County Nil, Mount Town. Nil, Mansfield won, the league leaders, leader Rodney Prey, Kenneth Dunn has just had the whole of Newport to run right through the box. Voice of all, I don't even know, George Reese, I don't even know who scored their goal, but such a poor goal to concede. They literally run right through our midfield, but terrible. They're just fucking queuing up. Get rid of it. Oh my oh, fuck fuck this is embarrassing oh. Oh, Look how much fucking time. Yeah, no, I'd, I'd fucking... I'd, 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 Maybe I'll be probably just see on the how is he oh. Newport nil, Mansfield won. It hurts. It really hurts. You know, going into it, I'm quietly confident, but you also are very wary of what Mansfield possess in attack and in midfield and overall threat the squad. You know exactly what sort of players they have and what sort of performance they can hit um, hit you for on any given day. They lost four games all season. So, you know, it was a game that we had to turn up for. We couldn't just turn up and win knowing that we, you know, can beat teams good teams at Rodney Parade we had to actually put the effort in and you know there was no effort in there there was no sort of desire they wanted everything more than us from start to finish and you know like sort of you look at it and you know it just was just really poor like you know every single 50-50 they won you know even Payne I thought was really bad Lewis you know overall the team just played like really poor and they deserved all three points but if you have enjoyed the vlog, please make sure to like, share and subscribe. It was a very, very tough one to watch. If we need, or if we want the playoffs, we need to be winning games ASAP. We can keep losing games. I know it's Mansfield. I know they're top of the league. But Saturday away at Stockport now is, is a must-win game. I don't care that, you know, they're top three, top four. I don't care. We need to go there and win. And then we've got more come on Tuesday, I believe. So there's big games coming up. Big, big games where we need to win. But like I said, in terms of today, Newport nil, Mansfield won. The league leaders storm on towards their potential League 2 title and promotion to League 1. If you have enjoyed the vlog, like, share and subscribe. I'll see you next week up the county.